<laughs> What's up? I didn't see you there. It's me, low key. I know you ain't see me coming, so I had to sneak up on you. Today, we're gonna be talking about change your lifestyle to change your life. So your daily day routines, your daily patterns, your habits, people that you involve yourself with. This can change your life. All you need to do is have a lifestyle of what you choose. To find the lifestyle that you want, you have to know what kind of lifestyles are there. And you have to choose the lifestyle that you would like to be chosen. So, for example, you could choose being poor. You could choose being rich. You could choose being medium class. It's all up to you and what you would like to be going down. But the thing is, right? You hang around people who do poor things, poor actions, or you ingest poor food, or you watch poor content. This will bring a poor lifestyle for you. But if you are into, you know, you halfway want to be rich, you watch rich shit, you know, um, you eat half like good food and sometimes bad food. When I say good and bad food, I'm talking about cheap food and then some food that you got to spend your whole check for or homemade food. But listen, because that's the good food. That's the good food. That's the good food. So, you know. That could put you middle class because you could watch back, you could watch just entertainment and sometimes read, but not read all the way. Right? And it could put you in middle class, right? Or some type of shit. And then there's rich. Where you you know, you knowing what you you what you you were taking and what that gonna give you. And what that what kind of what kind of proteins that's gonna bring to you. And you also are um you know, you watching, you know, not you not using, uh, you know, entertainment as something to actually entertain yourself. You kind of use it in a sophistic, like, not sophistic, what? <laughs> Sophisticated manner. So it actually uh, could put you in, um, you know, a position where you are, you know, um, going for it. Like, what? Damn point, Scott. Let's <laughs> gonna come back. Hold up, I've been doing the lifestyle. We were talking about manners. We was on um, sophisticated, sophisticated manner. But yeah, you know, it'll put you in that type of space. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They um, they don't, they don't just watch. They don't just watch. Like, you don't just watch stuff to watch it. You will very wary of what you watch, cause you treat your mind. I guess it's fucking billion dollars. So the rich, they ingest smart things. Like shit that you would not want to watch. Like this video that you watching right now, I made it something that all minds, no matter who rich, poor, or middle class, all can watch. All. So, so, but like a rich person, they don't fuck with it. But a person, you you wouldn't want to listen to no book. I ain't saying that you need to read a little book. Because sometimes you really just need to go out here. And that's how how you think they made that book. They went out there. Go out there. Tell your story. Get out there. Speak now. <laughs> but yeah, um, it's just like that. Because like, if you are you know choosing a lifestyle that's poorly that's what you'll get if you're choosing a lifestyle that's medium that's what you'll get if you're choosing a lifestyle that's rich that's what you get so you make sure you have the one that you would like to go down um and there's nothing 
you know, too much crazy. Because I don't think anything is wrong with actually, you know, being rich. You know, you're going to hate that rich person. But, hey, that don't help. That don't do nothing to them sleeping good. So, why you got a problem being rich? You know, I'm being rich. And sometimes you got to be rich mentally, spiritually, and emotionally. For that physical rich to even feel like something. But, um, yeah, choose that lifestyle. Peace. Thank mm-hmm. you.